morning. I'm Roger Numbers. Turns out one solution to greenhouse gas emissions may be a rock found in Oman. This according to a study out this month. Here to explain is Jörg Motter, a geochemist studying the rock. Welcome, Jörg. Thank you, Roger. Can you explain uh, what these are? Yeah, you know, this is the original rock we are looking at, which is the so-called peridotite. But if that rock reacts with uh, groundwater and with CO2, carbon dioxide, the product that comes out is this piece of rock. And you can see here the white stuff, which is magnesium carbonate. So this is the stored carbon dioxide in these rocks. So basically, the rock in your right hand plus carbon dioxide equals the rock in your left hand. Exactly. You actually permanently store CO2 as a mineral, so it's in an environmentally benign form. This may seem like a stupid question. I wasn't aware that rocks did anything. I thought they just sat there. Yeah, this is a common, I mean, the rock looks like a dead, you know, it's a material. But it also puts ions, chemical compounds like magnesium, calcium, sodium, into the water stream, which is then, you know, nutrition for in the oceans for living animals. It's a kind of dead material, but, you know, it, it's included in the life cycle on Earth. Thank you so much. Thank you, Roger. It was a pleasure for me to be here. Jörg hypothesizes this process could sponge one billion tons of CO2 per year. No small feat. That's all from us for now. We'll be right here tomorrow morning. Brought to you by the Lexus Hybrids and the Power of H.